People Animals Love, or PAL, has helped thousands of people in bringing comfort and companionship through the use of volunteers and pets for over 30 years. I wanted to do something with my dog that was meaningful, and I thought she would be more socialized if she participated in this program. She's very afraid of other dogs, and it's taken a while. Founded in 1982 by D.C. veterinarian Earl Strimple, PAL has gone above and beyond to help both students and elderly better themselves through the power of the human-animal bond. They're always very eager and, and they'll say, oh, it's Chloe, Chloe's here again. From clubs to tutors to simple hospital visits, PAL has shown the joys a pet can bring. They always ask, how old is she? What kind of a dog is she? But it's good because they interact, particularly in the Alzheimer's wing, it's a good thing. I saw an article in the paper about uh, people with dogs visiting uh, the Armed Forces Retirement Home um, and using dogs to uh, calm kids down whose first language is not English when they read. Kids start stuttering or an adults always saying, you know, you're reading too fast, reading too slow, that's not the way to pronounce the word. And the kids were getting flustered, so people bring their dogs in and then the adults leave and the kid stays with the dog and he reads a book to the dog and I thought that was really neat. And the kids' reading skills improved, so I thought I'd like to do that, both visit places where the vets are and maybe help some kids.